and this is my kitchen and this is my chicken Vamos better than Shunan. Come on, I'm going to go to Guys, welcome to another new episode of Tales Beyond Border. And as usual, you can see, I'm in my place. And today, I'm in a different place, a very special place. Because last time when I came for the camping, so that day, I found a cave. And since that day, from last week, I couldn't sleep properly because I was always planning to come back to this place again. And today, I'm here. And now, I'm gonna show you how the cave actually looks like. And that's literally unbelievable. I've never done it before in my life. I always wanted to be in a place that has a cave where I can make a shelter and something. So probably this is this is the first day I'm gonna start doing this kind of things from a channel. And to be very honest, I love doing this. So now I'm gonna show you how it looks like. So guys, I'm literally in the, the middle behind, of bro. nowhere, and that is my brother, the man in behind. Yeah. And basically, he's Ruffin, my brother, my best friend, and. This channel, we both started together. And look, finally we are here together now. And look at this view. And now, and now, I'm gonna show you the place, the cave. Look at this. And look at the view from here. It's a million dollar view. Just look. Damn. So this is basically the entrance of the cave. I can see some spider webs here. A good bit. Look at the rocks. I don't know if there's any snake in there. And look at this cave. This goes all the way down. And this is our camping place for today. Just look at this beautiful place. Covered for green, covered for sun, everything here. There's a fire pit, we can make fire here, hopefully. And make our food the best place to be is this. Actually, for me, yet so far, on my journey for Tailspin Border, this is probably the best place I've been yet so far. Because I've always searched for a cave. And look, here we are. Just look at this view from inside the cave. Just magnificent. Nah, it's a dream location, honestly. And look, Ruffin is chilling. Just look at this view. This is paradise. This is really paradise. But we have to be a bit careful because... Look, if I put my leg in a bad place, I'll be like tripping, 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 tripping all the way down. So guys, I'm feeling so happy and excited. So now it's time for us to collect some woods. And this is a fire pit. It's already in a good place. This is where I'm gonna make my fire. I got this. This thing is solid dry. So I'm probably gonna make my fire like this. I've got the woods. That's right.
nicely pine tree. And these are very good fire starters. I'll take a couple of them. Oh, that's hard. Let's go. So guys, this is the amount of wood we have collected for our fire. And now we will start our fire. Damn, I'm so tired. Collecting woods is never easy, but we're lucky. Even though it's winter, it's not raining. The weather is very beautiful. You can already see how beautiful the weather is. It's sunny and damn, this breeze is heavenly. So let's make our fire, guys. Let's have our fire. Man, I don't mind staying here for the whole night. This is a good place. And this is a good wood. So I'm gonna start from the base. I know it's gonna light very quick because these things are very dry. Nah. Not as much as I expected it to be, but that's alright. See? Easy. So that is where it starts. This is what it was missing. Very good to go. Let's take them out of there. It's gonna be safe. Let the sound. Put the fire rise. And any insects, any mosquito in the cave, we just run their ass out now because of the smoke, because of the heat. Woo. I'm, I'm feeling excited. Yeah, bro. Isn't this nice? <laughs> nice and warm. I know, I know, bro. So, guys, my fire pit is ready. I'm gonna make the fire. I've got two rock boulders just next to it. This is a grill that I got from the house, so I'm gonna place it just like this, put the chicken right there in there. I let the chicken grill in its charcoal. I'm a big fan of this food. Now you want to give me the food behind the sand and then break. Okay guys, back to my kitchen and here is my chicken. So, so look, this is the whole chicken I've got from my house. And this is where I'm gonna place it basically. But I have to pull the chicken a little bit more so it gets a proper heat. I think that is fair enough heat. Oh, just look at that. You can literally just hear the sizzle. Look at the color. Look at the sizzle. It's already burning. You can see the color in there. I was carried away because I saw a lot of fish down there. It's very unfortunate, but I was this much close to catch a fish. 
probably next time yeah next time I'm, I'm definitely fishing my bring my fishing rod I can still see oh, that dam from there to there it's full of fish I don't know what fish is that but that's big fish look at the water fish I'm tired my chicken is cooking just right at the back and this is life for me Guys, it's three o'clock in the afternoon and I'm just preparing my salads. I got some cucumbers, tomatoes and red onion and some green chilies. And trust me, I've never ever cut salads in a better place like this before in my life. I'm loving it. I got some scratches, but it's all right. But your cucumber is really good. What's up, Karin? I'm the chili bay, got some green chilies. <laughs> They're not spicy though, so it should be alright. Freshly cracked pepper makes the whole thing a lot different. Lovely. I'm gonna oil it. Just look at this color. Guys, here we are. Our chicken is ready. It's almost half past four. The sun is setting. And look at our table. We got salad, we got a monster, we got chola salsa, and our chicken. And now I'll place it straight in there. Wow, wrapping. It is just cooked to perfection. Just there. Like that. Yeah, crispy now on those chicken. <laughs> <laughs> so, just toasting your tortillas a little bit. Make them soft and be ready to go. Just look at that. Food is ready. <laughs> Thank you, Rafin. Monster? Alhamdulillah. Yeah. <laughs> Alright, this is a leg. Crunchy. Look at the leg, man. Oh, it's cooked. Just rightly cooked to perfection. This is good. Thank you, Rafin. Hey, the salsa. Let's take it in, bro. Let's shake it, bro. Shake it off. I'm going to put some salsa on my chicken. I'm that juicy. That's it. It's a spicy salsa, okay? Yeah. It's similar to my ring. I'm going to take a bit of chicken, a bit of cucumber. Tomato, red onion, green chili. Damn, my mouth is watering. It's been my room. Mm. Spicy. This is good. The food is really good. Would you have ketchup? No. Ketchup? I'm going to have ketchup. Yeah. Okay. I'll have ketchup. Sorry, bro. Look at this view. The sun is setting and we're enjoying our food. Yeah. Alhamdulillah. We'll see you dropping. 
I was scared. I thought the chicken would be cooked properly, but it's beautifully cooked. I mean, I love it, sir. Finally. Mm. It's real tacos. <laughs> no, no, good chicken. We didn't <laughs> eat a single thing for the whole morning. <laughs> yeah, we did. We had bread with butter and a bit of coffee, and that's it. But this is good. This is good food. Time to say goodbye. If you like my video, please hit the like button, also the subscribe button as well. And hope to see you soon on my next video again. Till then, take care. Bye bye.